the Department of National Defense finally signed the contracts for the Philippine Navy's two units of HDC-3 100 missile armed corvettes being built by South Korea's Hyundai Heavy Industries. The corvette acquisition project Lot 1 platform and launches is part of the Horizon 2 phase priority projects of the revised AFP modernization program, procured under government-to-government -government negotiations with the government of South Korea and Hyundai Heavy Industries. The Corvette acquisition project Lot 1 platform and launches has a budget worth 25 billion Philippine peso and will be paid using multi-year obligatory allocations. The Department of Budget and Management released the special allotment released order three weeks ago, worth 3.75 billion Philippine peso or 15% of the total approved budget for contract. Notice to proceed and official steel cutting ceremony to follow by January 2022 or before the end of President Duterte's term on June 2022. The HDC-3100 Corvette has a displacement of 3,100 tons, a length of 116 meters, 2 meters longer than previously reported, and a width of 14.6 meters, cruising speed of 15 knots, a cruising range of 4,500 nautical miles. The HDC-3100 Corvette is equipped with vertical launch system anti-ship missiles, in which Max Defense Philippines said that it could be MBDA's vertical launched missile interception, combat and self-defense missile air defense system, an anti-air multi-target all-weather, fire and forget short and medium range missile system. The HDC-3100 Corvette is also equipped with a 3D active electronically scanned array radar for its anti-aircraft detection capabilities. In which Max Defense Philippines also reported that it might be the Henselt TRS-4D radar. According to Henselt, Henselt TRS-4D radar is the latest member of the C-band naval radar family. Based on the most advanced gallium nitride active electronically scanned array sensor technology with multiple digitally formed beams. The HDC-3100 Corvette will be the first naval ship bought by the Duterte administration for the Philippine Navy, although the two Jose Rizal class frigates contract was signed under the Duterte administration, it was officially part of the Horizon 1 phase of the revised AFP modernization program. Air